Hi beauties, today I'm going to be showing you some fun little ways that you can glam up your girly space, whether it's an office, your makeup room, or just your vanity area. I like to take the candle jars from Bath & Body Works and clean them out and fill them with my favorite nail polishes of the season. Not only is this pretty, but it also allows me to use all my polishes up without letting them dry out. The next thing is an idea that I got off of Pinterest. It is just getting a flower vase and filling it with pearls and then topping it with your favorite flower at the moment. You can't have a glam space without a little bit of glitter, so I purchased this candle from the dollar store and with a little bit of Mod Podge, I added little dots of glue all along the candlestick and then I took some gold glitter and of course you can use any color of glitter that you prefer and I just sprinkled it all over the candle and just allowed it to dry out and then repeated the same on the other side and I really like the way this came out. I've been thinking of doing uh, some more in different colors. This next thing also involves glitter. Uh, all I did is purchase these glitter papers from the craft store. I found mine at Michael's and I just cut it to the size of the picture frames that I already had on hand and framed them and voila! You have yourself a little tray or just uh, some wall art, it depends. There's so many different ways that you can use this. I personally um, decided to use it as wall art but here are some ideas of how you can use your tray. Now this next little project has to be my favorite out of the bunch and it is simply getting a Bath & Body Works cleaned out candle jar and with that same glitter paper that we purchased from the craft store, uh, taking that and putting it on the inside and then taping the inside together and don't worry it doesn't have to be perfect because we are going to top it off with flowers and it's going to hide that tape. And I purchased this bouquet of flowers from uh, Michael's craft store, it was only $7 which is an amazing deal for all of these flowers and then I went ahead and just cut all the flowers off because I don't really like the way the green looks and went ahead and formed two little bouquets and you can either have it with one bouquet or you can add the second one which is my preferred look. I just love the fullness of it. That is all I have for you today. I really hope this video gives you some ideas. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And also stop by my blog from a purplechair.com. I will have lots of pictures on there of everything that we talked about. And don't forget to subscribe. I will see you on my next video. Bye.